ExpressVPN connection suddenly dropped. How to fix? This troubleshooting guide is for users seeing the VPN connection has unexpectedly dropped screen. To proceed, click on the screen that shows the message you are seeing, Part 1, VPN connection unexpectedly dropped, no network lock. 1. Click or tap on cancel to stop the reconnection. 2. Try to access any website with your default internet connection. If you are able, proceed to step 3. Otherwise, proceed to step 5. 3. Connect to a different ExpressVPN server location and then try to use the internet as normal. You can also consult ExpressVPN server list to choosing the best server location for your needs. Then, you connect to a different server location that works for your operating system or device, such as, ExpressVPN Windows app, ExpressVPN Mac app, ExpressVPN iOS app, ExpressVPN Android app, ExpressVPN Linux app, 4. If step 3 does not work, change your VPN protocol and then try to use the internet as normal. Review the summarized info on changing VPN protocol below, by default, ExpressVPN uses the UDP protocol, which is blocked in some countries, especially in the Middle East. For optimal performance, please choose the protocols in the following order, OpenVPN TCP L2 TP PPTP Note, ExpressVPN does not recommend using PPTP unless absolutely necessary. PPTP offers only minimal security. How to change the protocol for ExpressVPN Windows App 5.x, ExpressVPN Mac App 5.x, ExpressVPN Android App 5.x, ExpressVPN iOS App 5.x, ExpressVPN Linux App 1.x, ExpressVPN Windows App 3.x, 5. There is likely a problem with your default internet connection. Part 2, VPN connection unexpectedly dropped, with network lock. 1. Click or tap on cancel to stop the reconnection. 2. Disable network lock. Later, 3. Try to access any website with your default internet connection. If you are able, proceed to step 4. Otherwise, proceed to step 6 4. Connect to a different ExpressVPN server location and then try to use the internet as normal. 5. If step 4 does not work, change your VPN protocol and then try to use the internet as normal. 6. There is likely a problem with your default internet connection.